Between the Arts District and the world famous Fremont Street Experience is the Jewel. The Jewel is a 344 unit high rise located in downtown Las Vegas. And today we are featuring one of those units for sale. So make sure you stick around because that tour is coming up. Hey guys, welcome back. My name is MJ. I'm a realtor out here in Las Vegas, Nevada, working with the Berkshire Hathaway brand. And here on this channel, we tour all around the Las Vegas Valley, looking at builder model homes and existing inventory to make your next shopping experience for your next home all the more easy. If this is the first time you're stopping by and checking out my channel, I really appreciate it. If you do enjoy this type of content, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell notification so you don't miss a single beat when I upload on Fridays. And on today's video, we're actually going to downtown Las Vegas to check out a unit for sale in the Jewel. The Jewel is a 15 story high rise located between the Arts District and the Fremont Street Experience. Today's video was actually requested by a viewer by the name of Fast Philosophy. Make sure you check out their channel below in the description and in the card above. They do have lots of great content on their channel as well. But back to topic, we are going to be touring a unit which is located on the ninth floor, has fantastic strip views, especially at nighttime. It is a two bedroom, two bath condo that was converted from a one bedroom that was originally open and more like a studio. But he converted it to two bedrooms and we're gonna be taking a look at that today as well as some of the amenities in the area and around Las Vegas as a whole. So make sure you stick around to the end of the video for that. But as for now, let's get out there and get this tour started, come on. And welcome to downtown Las Vegas, everybody. This is the Jewel, 15 stories. We've got about 344 units in here. Let's go on ahead on upstairs. The Jewel itself does have lots of amenities included, so make sure you stick around till later in the video. I'll be going over all that, as well as some of the features around Las Vegas and the immediate area. Let's head on in. All right, welcome inside a 353 Bonneville Avenue, unit 910. This unit is for sale. It is two bedrooms, two bath, 1,270 square feet, and also includes a two car undercover garage. As soon as you enter the unit, you're greeted into a wonderful view of the strip out of those windows, which are letting in a lot of natural light. You walk straight into the kitchen. You have a very lovely kitchen here with quartz countertops with a waterfall edge. And then the stainless steel appliances are included as well which is the refrigerator, the microwave, the stove, the stove top, and the dishwasher. The single bowl stainless undermount sink with the industrial type faucet as well. Here's a closer look at the quartz. Looking over to the backsplash now, You'll notice how it has that really beautiful sheen with the brick pattern. It goes really well with the industrial design of this unit. And then the cabinetry does have a really nice shine to it as well. It is a single face and really goes nicely. Next, we're gonna look into this closet here. This is where your stackable washer and dryer will be. It is very compact. These are full size here, but they are stackable as well and it's very functional for condo units. As mentioned before, this unit does have an industrial type design to it. What I mean by that is some of the concrete is exposed on the walls and you'll see the piping up above as well. It does add a really nice ambiance to the unit and I really enjoy it personally myself. The walls that don't have the exposed concrete will have that drywall on there and you can paint it to whatever color you like. Originally, this bedroom was not here. It was added on as well as the closet to make it a fully functional bedroom. The current owner does have it set up with the two separate futons, so you could have extra guests come and stay with you. There's the TV wall mount there with a really nice view of the strip out of that window. Here shortly, we'll go out on the patio and we'll take a look at that strip view. And it is actually very stunning. It overlooks the pool area to the facility as well. Also, as I mentioned before, the flooring in here is a wood look porcelain tile. It is throughout the entire unit. It has a really soft gray feel to it with that wood look pattern. 
With that color and pattern, it does give really a nice warm and inviting ambiance to the condo as a whole. Coming into the first bathroom here, this bathroom is for that bedroom that we were just in. It has matching cabinetry with a single vanity there. You'll have a shower tub combo, making it a full bathroom. There is a medicine cabinet on the wall there as well. Your HOA dues, which I want to talk about here for a second, will include a resort style pool with cabanas, a spa, and fire pit. You have outdoor kitchens for grilling in the summertime. There is a movie theater on site exclusive to the Jewel residence. There's a two story fitness center with an indoor pool and strip views. You have a 10th floor Vino deck that has strip views as well for socializing, as well as on site dry cleaning, dedicated concierge. You have monthly events, you have a pet walk, 24 hour security, an electronic vehicle charging station if you own such a vehicle, and Wi Fi in the common areas, on site HOA, and finally there's a retail area on the base floor as well. We're just coming out of the master bedroom there. It does have that nice window with the strip view as well. Um, it's very, very comfortable sized. Then you have the master bathroom here with a separate shower tub with the dual vanities and the quartz countertop. You have a tile along the wall there in the shower. And to the right here will be the water closet, and then the walk-in closet straight ahead, which actually wraps around the corner, and I'll show you that here in just a second. Some quick features about the Jewel. It did begin construction in mid-March of 2006 and finished up in June of 2009 at a cost of $178 million. There's 344 units in here. That includes well over 100 different types of floor plans ranging from 600 to 2,000 square feet. That's going to about wrap it up for the interior tour. Next up, we're gonna head outside and take a look at the balcony. That overlooks the pool area and has a wonderful strip view. And here we are, looking east, down to the south where the strip is, and then to the west towards Red Rock. Right over to the right here, there is a large mass transit station just in front of the World Market Center there. And then a couple other high rises in the vicinity. There's the pool area with the cabanas, and day beds, and the private patio. Well, you're probably wondering sitting here, well, that's what it looks like during the day, but what about at night? With a view like this, we need to know what that looks like. Well, here it is. How nice would it be to finish up your day with a glass of wine, or a nice whiskey looking at the world famous Las Vegas Strip. Don't forget, you're only minutes away from the world famous Fremont Street experience. And being so close to the Arts District, the Container Park is a great place to visit for food and shopping. Being downtown, there's wonderful dining options available. There is greens and proteins right here on the facility, as well as world-class dining throughout Las Vegas altogether. If you're a shopper, you definitely got that available to you. And when you shop till you drop, you can head back to your place, drop off your bags, head downstairs, grab a cocktail like this at the Classic Jewel, and talk to your favorite bartender. Don't forget some of those other amenities that are right on site. You got the local shopping, including the barber shop. You have an on-site movie theater, as well as a two-story workout facility. And then of course, if you enjoy the great outdoors, you have Red Rock Canyon for sightseeing, picnicking, and hiking. You have Lake Mead right at your doorstep, if you prefer those water sports instead. If you like hiking up in the mountains, you got Mount Charleston, just about an hour away. And then of course, don't forget about Valley of Fire, which is just a little bit to the north. But why do you need all that when you have a resort style pool at your own house, just like this? Well, what'd you guys think? Did you enjoy this tour? Do you think the owner did a good job decorating? Do you like seeing condo units? Let me know in the comments below. And if you did enjoy the video, make sure you like it. Hit that subscribe button and that bell notification if you wanna see more content like this as I upload on Fridays every week. If you just fell in love with this condo and you wanna take a private tour of it, or perhaps you wanna view something else around the Las Vegas Valley, make sure you give me a call, text me, or email me. Be happy to schedule a private tour for you and your family. If you know somebody that's looking for a unit like this, or you think it would be a perfect fit for somebody you know, make sure you share this video over to them. I don't want them to miss out on an opportunity like this.
But as always, I appreciate you guys stopping by and touring with me today. I really hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you guys in the next one. Later.